So, yeah. Lawler, to reach the people that obviously you won't reach with the way you're coming off in your video, what would you <laughs> say to the, everybody that you're trying to help? What's your specific message? My specific message, especially if you're first starting out on YouTube, okay? You can have people that you idolize and are inspired by and things of that nature but you need to find yourself before anything i mean you can make content and it takes a while to make content and find yourself it really does but there's some guys out here that continue to just put out just shit after shit and you can tell that they're trying to be somebody else but the big thing about youtube is the first word youtube is you you know what i'm saying it's you expressing who you are and uh, i just want everybody to express who they are I'm saying like my boy air six i don't know if you watch his videos now he has one of those annoying dubstep fucking 3d image <laughs> intros that right? i hate i can't stand those intros man i have some kind of like that but you know i try to fade it in and out in a way that you don't even like know you know I, it's just like almost like a watermark in my videos you know what i'm saying okay. like i used to do it in the beginning like everybody else and have a little dubstep but i felt like that wasn't me and personally i find it annoying I, I think a lot of other people do too but i mean i could be wrong i don't know Not for it. <laughs> but yeah the the main thing is is that people lose what youtube is all about they lose what youtube is all about they see money and that is their driving force their driving force is not to make content a lot of times it's to make money and some people you know some people there's people out there that genuinely like make content for themselves you know what i'm yeah. saying like but if you can't watch your whole video and you know be happy with it and i mean it's just i i don't know like <laughs> there's no, people it, it makes that, total sense my man. personal opinion i guess just they should probably just not even post <laughs> right <laughs> because i no, waste I'm my time kidding. watching their videos every once in a while <laughs> yeah you just want people to find themselves and actually when they post be themselves instead of trying to just straight copy off of people and you know just it's not really their content it's right. them copying somebody yeah exactly you tell that it's not exactly. their content and i get that but like um a video i was thinking which you inspired because i kind of knew what you were going with the video i kind of got the message whatever yeah so i knew where you were going with it now my the video you inspire is like talking in general versus being specific and because you didn't specifically say this this and that because you didn't break down those walls that people are going to throw up because they're feeling offended or they can't relate or whatever mm -hmm. it's like that's the difference between talking in general and then being specific because most of the time when you talk in general you start hurting people's feelings they start feeling some kind of way and they don't they miss the message entirely oh i know i lost some subscribers but that's okay <laughs> right? I, it doesn't it doesn't bother me you know what i'm saying i think that the majority of the people i think that a lot of people got what i was trying to say you know what yeah. i'm saying like i think that my subscriber base i think that i have a little bit more of an adult subscriber base like i think a lot of like youtube is focused around younger the younger crowd but my content because i'm pretty harsh i curse i don't give a fuck you know what i'm saying i just yeah. i say whatever and i just you know and this is my time being me you know what i'm saying like all day long i have to go be somebody else i have to leave my house uh go to this office and be somebody who i'm not you know what i'm saying and i'm you know i do that for the money you know because you know i, I gotta pay the bills i got a family yeah. you know what i'm saying so I, I i have to do that but Honestly. whenever i come home i try to be as me as possible you know what i'm saying so i think that i know that i offended a couple people out there because they have videos like that but if you're posting this, I want to just let everybody know that I've made those videos too. I'm I'm not a, I'm not exempt to what I said. Right. I'm not exempt either. I'll put it that way. Is that I, I'm not exempt. I fall into all those same categories and I was saying that to myself just as much as I was saying it to everybody else. You know what I'm saying? If yeah. you feel what I'm saying. Yeah, uh, definitely. See, yeah. Th that's exactly why I yeah. was like, I, I mean, need like, you to get on Skype because 
Like I said, <laughs> I, I've seen the video. I love the video. I got the message. I knew exactly where you were heading. But I knew there was going to be people that you offended. There was going to be people who think they know what you're talking about. They don't really know what you're talking about. And then there's just yeah. going to be those people who are just like, I don't know how to feel about it, so I'm not going to say nothing about it. And that's just where it's going to fall. And it's going to be that super minority that was just like, I know where he's going with this. And I was a part of that super minority. And I just wanted to get some clarification from you and everything. And like I said, just throw myself out there, just like you're throwing yourself out there. Like, I did this too, this and that. And whatever my message is, just be yourself. You know, just like you, I'm kind of tired of everybody doing this, you know, copy paste thing, like for a long time. I don't know if you remember this, but this is when like Sneeko was blowing up and everybody tried to do their commentary like Sneeko and they were like chopping it up real weird and it sounded like it was talking like super fast about Call of Duty <laughs> just like ugh what the fuck is this I remember whenever there was a bunch of Sneeko clones going around I mean Sneeko kind of got his style off of Eddie the Chump who got his style off of uh there's a dude damn what the fuck was his name I'll think of it but he got I mean you know those cut commentaries you know that it's not even just a cut commentary but it's a cut commentary with a lot of like fast intelligent sounding words yeah. to try to blow your mind really and i like the way sneeko does it but not everybody can pull that shit off like exactly. the way i do it that's exactly I've been, my point not everybody I, can that's pull that shit off i've been doing lately actually yeah yeah nobody <laughs> not a lot exactly and like you got to be pretty intelligent see knowing yourself right that's what the message of your video is and me knowing myself i would never try to do some shit like that because i know cut commentaries just do not work for me you know what i'm saying i talk fast enough me cutting some <laughs> shit up it's gonna sound like i'm talking <laughs> gibberish and shit so like i would never ice talking or right <laughs> so i would never try to do some shit like that but um but yeah, i definitely got it and that's why i wanted to talk with you about it and everything I'm definitely going to post this, and that's yeah. what the whole thing was about. Everybody thought I was talking about something. They were like, ooh, who are you talking about right? now? <laughs> Who's all I'm talking shit about that? Like, all I do is talk shit about people. I mean, I make fun of people because they're they're funny, man. Like, I make fun of... I don't hate Biblical Reaper. I make fun of him because he's an easy target. That's why. Right. He's an easy target, and he's bigger than I am. I know he's not going to respond, and that's why I do it. I, I, I mean, I, I do it to make people, like, because a lot of people watch him, so I want to, like remind everybody that he's human look at this funny ass dude look at what i'm doing i'm making fun of him he talks about how hard his shit is to do he's got a thousand dollar microphone this is a 25 dollar microphone <laughs> you know what i'm saying right. and it sounds fine yeah, it's so hard to good. do his green screen stuff he, he he pays for all this stuff he pays for his uh, he paid for his banner, he pays for um, his thumbnails, he pays for all of his intros, outros, all his shit. He pays for all that shit. He doesn't do anything on his own except for read some tweets really poorly and, you know, <laughs> look like uh, just a pasty fat dude on a mic. So he's easy target and that's why I make fun of him. That dude was like, oh, you, you were talking about copycats but you do the same thing. No. I do not do the same thing. And that's the difference between you and a lot of other people. They don't understand the kind of like comedic mind that I'm bringing to the table. It's it's a lot of it's satire. I'm just making fun of shit just to make fun of shit. I'm not trying to be malicious or mean or anything like that because yeah. it's just not me. I like to laugh and stuff like that. I tried to do commentaries before that were like everybody else's commentaries. And I tried to be like normal and regular and not myself and i never saw growth only whenever i started being myself on youtube that's whenever i started to grow and that's just that's what i want everybody to do you know what i'm saying i, I feel like everybody's got some kind of artistic nature in them especially if they you know they want to do it you know what i'm saying they want to do youtube you know there's some kind of drive not everybody's in it for money but you have to remember that you're not in it for money you right. know what i'm saying you have to remember that you don't don't let the sub count and the view count cloud your brain you know that's what i let happen to me whenever I'm on so i try to do things that i thought were good for my brain or, or i mean my sub count my view count shit like that but once i found out who i was and started changing my shit up and being myself that's whenever i saw growth so i want everybody to grow you know what i'm saying yeah. i don't think that every other community channel doesn't really work that well uh 
play uh, what is that uh fps finest look they, does can anybody even post oh on that thing God. anymore i'm pretty you sure there's people saying? posting on it but like how do, how do i put this like the way biblical reaper ran that channel he ran it into the ground from the start he gave it to Budzy and let Budzy run it, who is not a big YouTuber, who doesn't know how to pick commentaries or anything. And I kind of had to stop watching Budzy because he's just, he was too much like Biblical Reaper. Oh, wow. Like, he would just, whatever Biblical Reaper would make a video on, he would just make a video on it, kind of. But, you know, just talk about it on his own. He wouldn't, like, read tweets or anything like that. It was just, it was too fake. You know what I'm saying? And oh, I, I mean, it, it, some people like that stuff. Some people like that stuff. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I mean, it's, I guess it's all preference. But, you know, me personally, as an avid YouTube watcher, avid. Yeah. Definitely. There's shit that I just don't want to see on YouTube, and I just feel yeah. Some people are just being fake, you know, and I just don't want them to be fake. I want them to be real. Yeah. I want my YouTubers to be real. And Definitely. It's just out it's love of the community and for the love of YouTube. That's all it is. You know? I feel it. Yo, <laughs> I'm gonna cut it here. I'm gonna send you the audio. If you wanna use it, you can go ahead and use it. Nah, uh, man, don't worry about it. I'm not gonna use it. Right. If you're gonna post it, I'm not gonna post it. No, no, I'm gonna post it. I'm definitely gonna post it. So, yeah. Um, I mean, it might be two parts. It's a little bit over 20 minutes or something like that, but I'm definitely gonna post it. And um, like I, I know said, I just put that info. <laughs> I mean, you know, like I said, it was like kind of like an interview or whatever, and just letting you get your piece out there, explaining because what a lot of people don't know as as viewers versus us YouTubers. You know, we chop down videos into like five, ten minutes or whatever. And it yeah. might actually be like a 30 minute explanation or something like that about the video. Your video, while it was direct, short, straight to the point, you know, it was like really short, but it got its message across. But if it had this almost 25 minute explanation, more people will understand it. And this is what this was. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's true. That's true. It really wasn't for viewers. It was really for YouTubers. I think that, I think it's better to, for me personally. I mean, I, I try to do stuff for viewers as well. Like a lot of the satire stuff, like the drama alert. And I mean, drama alert is kind of copying, but I mean, it's, it is kind of copying, but it is, <laughs> I just try to put my own spin on it yeah. as much as possible. I mean, it's, Keemstar would never pay attention to our shit. Yeah. But I think our shit is funny enough where somebody needs to talk it. about yeah. it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Somebody needs Definitely. to talk about it. And I stole his format a little bit, but like I said, it's got my own twist on it. So, I mean, it's I mean, not. I feel like you should have like, kept going with the whole copying, the whole parody thing. Oh, I will. If there's ever. I have to wait, man. I have to wait for something that's worth making fun of, really. I just wait until one of my friends, somebody shits on somebody else and they're like oh okay i can make a video on that <laughs> because i know that the people who are involved aren't going to get too butt hurt you know what i'm saying yeah. like i really am not out here to like make anybody feel terrible like me and drew games we we still be talking on twitter you know what i'm saying like he 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 ain't got no hate for me just because i made that video he knows that what he did was kind of kind of cheesy he knows it but he, he i mean i called him out on his bullshit is what yeah, it is because i be calling people out on their bullshit and i i would only call somebody out if i know that you know we'll, we'll still be cool afterwards you know what i'm saying i'm not trying to alienate anybody or make any enemies out here you know yeah. not having real drama with anybody mm -hmm. fuck that i got enough of that shit with my fucking baby mama you know oh, what i'm saying <laughs> <laughs> all right well, let me know. cut this <laughs> that's <laughs> plenty <laughs> oh my god all right uh, all this youtube shit you know, like the video man. like the video and all that jazz uh make sure yeah. you check out my boy lawler as y'all can see i'll link the video that we're talking about in the description with all that being said we'll catch y'all later